What's going on, ninjas? What is going on? It is Tuesday, and I really hope each and every one of you had a great Christmas or any other holiday that anybody else uh, celebrates at this time of the year, for that matter. New Year's is just around the corner, and many plans for the ninjas for this upcoming new year but i wanted to really give you a couple of updates of what's going on right now i am out and about and i was doing some things i stopped at the post office dropped off a bunch of stuff so oh man thank you so much for the loyalty and support sgninjas.com guys i'm almost i'm actually running out of stuff and i'm trying to ooh, i'm trying to decide should i order more or should I just not? I don't know. Should I? Should I not? I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll see how many more orders come through. But that means so much to me. Thank you so much uh, for ordering. Right now, the hottest stuff is the hoodies and the hats. Of course, you still got your uh, cotton shirts and uh, polyester shirts. Now, those are really nice in the summertime. Um, so, I dropped that off. Picked up a couple of checks at the P.O. Box. I'm not in the truck, as you can see. I normally would be if I was doing any kind of quoting or anything like that. But this one was on the way, and so I was literally passing it, and I'm like, ah, eh, why not? I'm here. So, by the way, real quickly before I move on with that, I want to do. I do want to bring you up to date on those three rental downtown properties. Oh yeah, we landed all three of them. Got them. Gonna have to get them scheduled this week and uh, put them on schedule. Um, <clears throat> and then they're going to be bi-weeklies as uh, spring comes around, which is fine. Also, he really liked uh, the conversation we had, the owner, uh, or the landlord for that matter, whatever you want to call it. And he said, hey, I got one more that's a little bit deeper in downtown, Nick. Do you want to go any deeper to downtown, Nick? I'm like, of course. So we're going to go check out one more, see what that's all about, and hopefully we'll get that one too. So, uh, guys, just more properties are coming in, even though it's wintertime. This is awesome because I am, I am planning and, you know, getting everything situated for next season. And uh, obviously, a lot of stuff is coming up. Once the new year hits, I'm making a bunch of decisions. 2014 is going to be up for sale. I'm going to get rid of that truck because it is a two-door. Nothing wrong with the truck. It's a great truck, but it's a two-door. And so I will be selling that and then looking for another four-door as a backup. Uh, nothing new. I'm probably going to go used on this one because, again, keep in mind, it's going to be a backup truck. So most of the time, it's just going to be probably just sitting. But. I will use it. I'll switch them out, whatever. Uh, it's a backup truck. So that plus the mowers, I'm putting all the mowers up for sale coming up new year. And uh, then I'm going to go ahead and start looking for new ones. Call a couple of these dealers um, that have touched base with me or I've touched base with them and see what's coming up uh, and the decisions I'm going to make as far as what route I am going to go next. Okay, so. Rental properties, all these things are coming through. Got another commercial that contacted me, and they want me to check it out and give them a quote. They actually have a company doing it right now, but they're not happy with them um, for a couple of reasons. I honestly think the yard looks great myself, so I think they're doing a good job, but I don't think they like the scheduling that this company's uh, uh, able to to provide to them so they usually they said they cannot cut it closer to the weekend they want it closer to the weekend and this company cannot do it any other time than earlier into the week i don't see what the problem with the company on that is i think if you're a company you don't want to lose a customer it's not a problem to rearrange a few things even if you have to call a couple other clients and change some things um you know why 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 not do that and not lose your uh clients but um, it is a church, by the way, so I'm going to go ahead and just drive around real quickly, show you, give you an idea, and I am uh, going to be in touch this week with the lady. I've got her name and number, and we're going to be texting and calling uh, back and forth, and uh, I'm going to ask a couple of questions that I have, and uh, they want it weekly, year-round, and uh, since it is a, a church, uh, they want it year-round. <coughs> so I will show you that here in a minute. I'll drive around, give you a little bit of ideas. That's about it, guys. Uh, like I said, did a couple of errands, dropped off some stuff at the post office. Thank you again so much for Check out Mama Ninja Kitchen up here, okay? Because 
not only do we do a bunch of challenges, but, you know, we recorded the other day for our Christmas uh, gift opening, and I don't think she's posted it up just yet. I think it's going up tonight, if not tomorrow, but uh, it's going to be, it was pretty interesting. She also caught Santa in the act, actually, believe it or not. Uh, he was uh, in our living room just as he was setting down gifts. She was... Uh, she woke up uh, to go get a drink, and she heard something, and she went back there, and and uh, luckily she had a camera on her, and she like like in surprise saw a big, large figure guy all red, and he's putting down gifts and stuff, and she went click, and right as she did, he turned around and gave her a look, and uh, then she kind of freaked out and ran back to the bed. <laughs> so, all right, so check that out, Mama Ninja Kitchen. Um, sgninjas.com for all your ninja gear like i said i'm running out of stuff i'm actually debating should i order more or not hoodies are hot hats are hot i'm not wearing any of today but uh and then of course you got your cotton shirts and polyester shirts uh which are really great for um uh this the upcoming season because those polyester shirts i'm telling you guys they keep you cool that, that's all i can say but anyway let me show you real quickly before it gets any darker this church this property i'll drive around twice i'll go around one way and then i'll come back and then i'll make i'll make a conclusion of this video and uh that's it tomorrow we're back on track pizza's back into town from his um visit with his family and uh we've got a big week ahead of us and we don't have many days available because new year's is just around the corner and i also take the day or two off for new year's at least that day new year's day maybe a day before new year's or try to finish it early uh to spend time with uh, a friend of mine who's coming over uh visiting from out of town and then just really enjoying the new year's which is something we all do every year so uh so we only got a couple of days this week which is fine we'll get everything done it'll be a good week and then uh you know next week uh with the new year it's gonna be a fresh start so all right stay tuned let's go check this out and uh, i'll be right back I did not get a chance to turn around and show you the other side. I can do it in another day. There was a police officer there uh, just chilling out. I didn't want to make him paranoid, and I didn't want him to pull me over and be like, hey, man, what are you doing? So, uh, But I think you got a good uh, most of it as far as around the building. There is a field that was on the other side of the parking lot that was fairly good size, but nothing too crazy. Nothing uh, a bunch of... Um, 48 54 or 61 inch decks can't handle so um but i'm gonna be contacting them it's a great account if i get it if not not a big deal uh, there's so much work coming my way it's uh it's it's crazy and sorry for this road guys it's uh quite quite bumpy um so that's it you know um uh, got those uh downtown landed and i've still got quite a few of uh projects and uh my regulars that i haven't even gotten to because we've just been so busy and i wanted to really get these holidays out of the way uh we've got a lot of mulch stuff coming up a bunch of shrubbery trimming and still mowing you know there's not much to mow but we mulch up some of the leaves that are on the ground and um you have to understand ninjas that when people pay me they're not just paying uh for a for their yard to be cut for example they are of course but it's more of a relationship ongoing business transaction because they're also paying not just for the service that I am offering, they're paying for honesty, trustworthy, uh, someone that uh, just keeps up their yard uh, every week or every two weeks and a year round going. So yes, the grass is obviously not growing as much as it would in April, but 
That doesn't mean that my services stop. I'm not saying all my customers do this, but a majority of them, which is one of the reasons why I can offer a job position for one or two guys. And here's another thing you guys got to keep in mind. It's almost end of December into January and uh, which means a lot of companies this time of the year are laying everybody off or they're just saying hey I've got no work for you uh, maybe we can you can call me back in spring and uh, I'll uh, see what I got that's not the case with me for someone like pizza for example you know I am able to offer him a year-round job which is a great thing for me and a great thing for him so and my goal is to be able to hire another guy or two who will actually stick around because let's say if that previous ninja stuck around he would have a job year-round I would make sure I provide enough work that they keep some busy they're making checks and uh, I'm making money but um, hopefully uh, that's gonna be the case next year so I'm headed back home. You guys saw a little bit of that. I was really wanting to make a second walk through coming back, but I really didn't want to spook that cop. And I know he would have probably pulled me over just to say, hey, what are you doing? What's going on? Which was, a, which would have been totally fine, but I'm not in the mood to do that right now. So stopping real quickly at my uh, at my gas station here to get a drink. And, uh, and then that's it, guys. I'm just going to upload this video real quick and just wanted to say I hope everyone had a good Christmas with your families and uh you know stay tuned for a great exciting week a lot of stuff is coming up i hope you guys are uh doing great and i hope you guys have a lot of stuff coming up as well so see you ninjas take care and here i am as you can see peace out